We're driving the truck today. We're going to, uh, we're gonna head do a little excursion to Ikea. Our and, fridge almost died this morning. Oh man, this has been a bad, just been a bad it looked beginning. So, uh, oh, oh geez, I don't have my seatbelt on, Meek. <laughs> I feel like, I feel like. Uh, this truck is like so different to drive. You know what I feel like? What? Ace Ventura, when he's like, uh, he's in the, in the truck, like. Bouncing um, around. Whoa, God. Whoa. We need bookshelves. We mentioned this in a live stream, live stream earlier. Yes, maybe yesterday from when we we're recording yeah. this. Um, yeah, we, we desperately need some bookshelves because we have we, piles. We have like a hundred, a minimum of a hundred books that we don't have space for. So, you know what's funny about one of those bookshelves? What? It holds like, like 200 books. 180 bucks? Yeah. Oh man, we're screwed. Okay, we officially need to turn this I down. hate you. I was hoping you wouldn't notice it was hot. We don't get fall here in the Northeast. It goes from summer to winter. Like literally, it was like 80 the other day. The other day? The other day. So, what's your favorite thing? Oh, my favorite quote? Yeah. Uh, I don't know the quote verbatim, but it essentially goes, if you don't like the weather in New England, wait 10 minutes. Oh, ho, 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 ho. My Mark Twain said that. My Your Mark, Mark Twain? I said by Mark Twain. Oh. But then, like, I effed it up, so I added said that at the end, and I was just like, nope, that just sounds just as bad. My daddy liked my picture I sent him. Thanks, Dad. Going to Ikea the other day. Going to Ikea. Wow, wow, wow. Wow, wow. My ears just died. Why is there so much traffic? It's Saturday the other day. It's Saturday. Where's the oh, rest I, of your map? I like it like this. Wait, no, no, no. Where's the road that goes straight? Oh, it stopped doing that, Google Maps. What? Yeah, a lot of times it won't even show you other roads. What? It's a new thing and they'll write like names. We're not gonna make it. This truck, I know. Well, we gotta drive it more, Meek. Like, it feels better than it used to. So, like, my parents coming up here and driving, it must have helped because. Um, yeah, your, your dad was like, you know, it's like, I got on the highway and I just pounded it. <laughs> He's just like, I just floored it and it seemed to get better. And I was like, okay, man. Uh, you know that truck better than I do, I guess. Uh, you remember when he told us that, right? Nah, I was like, I was like, oh, man, I hope you didn't break anything. But sometimes you do just have to like kind of get. Well, don't they say you have to like drive cars on the highway, otherwise they get like crappy? Yeah, you're you're supposed to drive cars. Dr cars are dri made to be driven. If they oh. don't get driven, then they, you know, if Hot. you because what the, the saying goes, if you don't use it, you lose it. So my story from before, um, we were we were getting up, getting getting up early. We were gonna do a quick little D and D session today. Um, my never my friend um, overslept. overslept, and I was like, "Why is my voice going like this? This truck is ridiculous." We need, Meek, you know what we need so we could vlog better? Lavaliers. Take a guess. Take a guess what we need so we could vlog better. Lavaliers. No. Try again. That's a good guess, though. That's actually a, a reasonable guess. But try a more extravagant I'm guess. Because you usually try a more extravagant guess. Extravagant. Extravagant is the best word for it. A crazy good camera. No, 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 no. Man, you're 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 under underrating this. Extravagant, I said. A Tesla. You guessed it. Teslas are electric. They don't make noise when you're driving them around. They also don't have pickup trucks that are are Tesla. They will soon. You want to get the Tesla pickup pickup trip no. when it comes out? No. You want to get the Tesla pickup trip when it comes out? Nope. I want to get the cap to the kick with chocolate for it now. No. I think we should get the back of the TV show. <laughs> we were getting ready. Buddy couldn't make it. Well, he could make it, but then it was too late, and we're like, oh, we got a bunch of stuff to do today. We really, we, we have a we have a curfew. You know, we have we have things that we have to get accomplished today. So we ended up canceling D and D for for this morning. And then I was sitting next to the refrigerator, and I heard the refrigerator go, click, click, and then it waited like a minute, and then it goes. No, didn't it go click again? Click, yeah, it clicks off, yeah. Oh, I thought it clicked on. It clicks on and off. Click on. Click off, yes. Um, so, as it's doing this, I'm thinking like, oh no, the fridge is dying because if a real, if a compressor starts not staying on, that means that it's maybe a compressor, it may be the relay, I don't know. 
Um, so then I called my buddy and he's like, hey, did you check Did you check this? And I was like, let me go check that. So then I checked it and I was like, yeah, man, I think I need a compressor. And he's like, yeah, you may need a compressor. And then he's like, I think I got one for you so you can come and get it. And then, you know, you can figure that out. And I was like, all right, let me check this one last thing. He's like, yeah, check that thing and then let me know. He was getting a haircut. Apparently getting a haircut for like an hour. I don't know what kind of haircut he was getting, but like he has really short hair, so it must take a long time to get all the hairs cut because they're so short, you know. Um, he's probably getting like designs drawn on the side or something. You know how these kids are these days. Yeah, it, it worked. I, we, I was able to, I think, fix it. I, re, I replaced the relay on it and I was able to fix it, I think. But we're still gonna go get that compressor. But we're gonna go get that compressor. In case it doesn't work. In case we need to replace the compressor. Cause that's like 500 bucks. Yeah, it's like a $500 compressor. That's a lot of bucks. So we're gonna go do that. That was our morning. It's so stressful. Why do growing ups suck at doing things? We're gonna go pick that up and then we're gonna go to Ikea because that was the original plan. We were gonna play D&D a little bit and then go to Ikea um, and then come back home because we need those bookshelves, put those bookshelves in and record some, some stuff for you guys. And uh, that's it. This is such a long drive, Mick, and this yeah. truck is so noisy and like it's vibrating. It's pretty good though. Yeah, it's going good. I mean, I haven't like gotten dizzy yet. It's hauling. I'm doing 70. That can't be good for this truck. 75. Just, just I need to slow cruise. Down. Just cruise. Whoa, bro. Don't you have cruise control? I don't know. It's right here. Oh, uh, look. Cruise control. <laughs> All right, hold on. I, I legit didn't know I was going If we had a Tesla, we could just have it drive for us. It didn't feel like we were going that fast. I figured like in well, this truck. Well, that's good. I always thought it was weird that Ikea open so late yeah 10 o'clock i feel like it should be like a home depot and open it like seven six, in the six yeah <laughs> maybe at least eight o'clock i mean yeah eight o'clock is like a standard open then you have those time. weird places like hobby lobby that are closed on sunday like yeah that's just strange because like they lose so much business yeah sunday because yeah yeah sunday's a big shopping day yeah not for us hey maybe we can go get some wood later i asked you about that you said no I mean, maybe. It all depends on how far it is. I think it's like probably the same distance. That's the problem. Ugh. It's like a triangle. Like, like we live here, we're going here, and the wood shop is here. So it's like either way, we're, we're driving the same amount of distance, but we're pretty much doubling the distance because now we're going away in a different direction. I just realized I didn't know how much gas we had. We got good gas. We got good. <laughs> I, I checked. Like, Don't you worry. Never drive this truck. I checked. I just realized that. Uh... I was thinking about your friend and how he has kids and how like even when your kids are older it's like super stressful because like because kids suck i don't know like when you're oh. 18 or when your kids are 18 like you still have to worry like are they gonna go to college are they gonna get an education are they going to get a job after college are i feel they like they're able to pay off their student loan the real question is are they gonna get a job do you have to worry though you or are you do. just like you do your best and then you let them you you release the geese into the world. That didn't even happen for either of us. We still lived with our parents until the last possible moment we could. Yes, but our parents made, let us make decisions and let us make mistakes. Yeah. And we made plenty of mistakes and That's true. we're okay. Don't stress out about parenthood, guys. Just, if they're gonna be F-ups, they're gonna be F-ups. There's really nothing you can do about it. Don't stress. Be blessed. That's what I always say. What does that even mean? Don't worry about it. Why is it wet? Why is what wet? That thing. Oh, it's probably just greasy. Uh, so we got the uh, filter dryer and the compressor from my buddy over here. It's really bright outside. Um, Why is it hot? Because your face is here. You want to go to that store I mentioned? It's, in, it's like right next to there. I had the idea since we're like so far away from home. There's actually somewhere here that I want to go to go. Wait, did I just say goat? Goat to. Okay. So there's somewhere here that I want to go to. That's how I'm going to say it now. That's how it, you pronounce go. It's just goat. Um, I think, I, I forgot what this place is even called. It's called Elm City Games. Yeah, Elm City Games. Um, I follow them on Instagram and they're like a, like a gaming um, store. 
right? So they they like you could go there and like play games. They have like tables that you could sit down and play games and stuff. Um, games like what, like Warhammer, Magic the Gathering, that type of stuff. Yeah, but also like Catan, oh, that type of stuff too. So the hardcore board games. Yeah, the real board games, you know. So like not it's, Monopoly. No, no, that's that's not a board game. That's not a board game. I'm sorry. That's a family game. I haven't been there, so I don't really know anything about it. Uh, we're, we're gonna, you know, we're gonna go check it out. I want to see if they have any miniatures because I saw recently they posted a thing on there, and they were kind of showed off their like their mini shelf where they have like all their uh, unpainted minis. Um, so hopefully they have some. I can pick some up and uh, paint them up. Thoughts? We may get stranded. Um, I don't know. Feels fine. But the car feels fine, so hopefully it's okay. So I'm excited. I've never actually been to like a gaming shop uh, store type thing. They used to thing. have one in the mall right near us, and it was great. But was it like that type of gaming? Yeah, because uh, when I was like in, 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 in teenager, when I was in high school and I used to play Magic the Gathering, that's what they did. They had like cards you could trade. They had single card sales. You yeah, but they were. It was mostly pack. like a card shop, right? It was that. Pokemon, Yu-Gi-Oh. Warhammer, D and D. All that stuff. It was right. called Dragon something. I can't remember the name of the store now, but I was so upset. Brass Dragon, I think it was. And um, I'm upset because like it was a really cool store when we were younger, but you know, Waterbury, so no, nothing lasts. That's life, Meek. Nothing ever lasts. Especially in Waterbury. Yeah, you know, how many of those stores in that mall are the original stores? You can probably count on one hand. Hmm. Yeah, that's true. Um, hot, topic. hot topic. Is Spencer still there? Yes. Uh, um, FYE. Okay, maybe two hands. But it's a big mall. It's uh, not that big. It's not that big. Wait, okay. Well, the the jewelry stores, do they just count as one? I don't know, Meek. Are we really doing this right now? <laughs> you really want to go over the food, our... The food court has completely changed. Our like, specific mall. No, not the pizza place to the left. Yeah. Gone. Sabaro's not no, there. No, it's still the same. It's a new Sabaro! Place. Oh my god. Really? What are the odds? There's a sign that said Sabaro's on it. That's weird. I saw it, I said pizza thing, <laughs> and then you said Sabaro's, and I was like, wait a minute, did I just read Sabaro's? It's yes, not, I did. It's not there anymore. It's a different pizza place, but there is. Is one. Sabaro's like a chain? It must be a chain. It is. Oh, oh my gosh. I thought I, I thought my brain just like exploded. I thought I, I was a wondersmith and I made something happen. Do you know what logo I hate? Is that I think it's Home Depot Berkshire Foods. What does it look like? It's like a cartoon dude holding a cookie, and then he has another hand like here, and it's totally there's a cookie drawn on it, but they colored it in the color of his shirt. So it's like a round, random shape that's supposed to be a cookie that's not a cookie like the other hand. It is so weird, and I hate it. And every time I see one of those trucks, I'm like, what idiot approved this? For your like logo and I just need, fix it. Google I it. I must see this. Right? It's the weirdest, ugliest logo ever. Can you see it? It doesn't make sense. It's supposed to be a cookie. And his eyes are like yellow, like he's jaundice. <laughs> I never noticed. Oh yeah. He's like, yum, I have two cookies except one is part of my shirt. He's like, yum, I have a bowling ball and my shirt has a lump. Second you decide you have to pee, it's the end of the world. And if you don't pee right now, you're gonna die. I'm gonna Where pee am myself. I going? You're gonna take a You're gonna get off you're gonna keep what? Left? No, we got off the wrong exit. Oh. This is deceiving us. Take a left, take a left, take a left. Gonna, this, gonna... this is only a right. You're wearing oh a God. right only. We almost died. This is like the beach exit. Yeah. Okay, you're gonna take a left at the light. Okay. Let's see if this is it. There's wow, there's a lot of taco trucks over the here. Tacos in Mexico. Let me out. I'm gonna go pee. <laughs> they were all locked. Yay! I get to go pee in a potty that's portable. Oh, my God. It smells, it smells like It really does. It smells like right It does. Close the door. I know two things. One, you are super lucky that there happened to be portable toilets when you had to pee really bad. Uh-huh. 
Two, we got off the wrong exit. Yeah. Two. That helped. This smell is not appetizing. No. Um, like, can you imagine eating from one of these trucks? So here's the weird part. It smelled better in the porta potty than it does outside of the porta potty. And that porta potty has been there for like ages. That porta potty is old. I mean, they probably replaced the water and stuff in there. But it, it, you could tell inside, it's like all beat up and stuff. But like, I saw uh, graffiti. I saw people walking by, like holding their noses, and there's just like a thousand taco trucks here. Yeah, I don't know how you could eat. I do know also that that truck says we do cater. Oh, we do cater, son. For any social event. I'm gonna be honest. With you, I think it's the water. It because, is. It smells like, like dirty fish tank. Freaking water. I, I hate the ocean. I don't know like why people fish. like to live by the ocean so much. I, I don't know why, but like people always want to live by the ocean and it always smells. Every time I'm here, we're in Milford right now, pretty much. Yeah. And like whenever I have to go to Milford, I'm always like, I hate going to Milford because it always smells. It always smells like It smells like fish. Um, if you've ever had a fish tank and you have, and you've let like the water get a little dirty and like it smells like rotting food, like old food and like fish poop. That's what it smells like. I don't know if it's because it's just like New England. Just, just stinky water? No. Oh, I don't know. But, like, I mean, when we go to Florida, it's not that bad. You have to realize, too, because, like, look, it's low tide right now. So, like, that's probably not helping. All that gunk is, like, sitting on that, like, land. That's a good point. You know what I hate about New Haven? Everything? Yes. Um, it's, it's on this road. It's going to be on the left side. So you're going to maybe want to park up there more. It's past the two next lights. See? Uh, I hate the city where you have to pay for parking. I hate the city. The end, period. I hate any End the sentence, end the thought. It says that it's all the way back there, but I don't see it. I hate cities. I know, it's the worst. They suck. I didn't mention I hate cities. You sure did. I hate the city. Did I, did I mention? Figured, Me too. Me figured too. I'd mention it again. Did I mention? I hate the city. Me, me, me. I do too. You do too? Yeah. Oh man. Okay, now what? This guy's be careful gotta stop. With, be careful with the old man. Be careful with the old man. You almost killed him. I just paid like a dollar to park for 30 minutes. Maybe they moved. Okay. This is why we got confused. Yep, so they moved, apparently. <sighs> so let's, uh. So are you gonna pull it up on your GPS? Uh, you know which way to go no, we're, we're just gonna we're just gonna go for it and no, try to. No, is it to the right or left? I don't know. But I see Orange Street. We were we're we on Orange Street. We parked on Orange Street. I gotta pee. Is it legal for a Dunkin' Donuts to not have a bathroom? Yes, the one in Waterbury doesn't. Oh, the you're one right. In downtown. Yeah, the one by the by the the ATM, right? Yeah. I guess so. Super productive. Uh, we bought a bunch of toys, and um, five miniatures. That place is super cool. Um, they're really nice. They're very nice there, and uh, we'll probably be coming back next time. We have to buy more bookshelves. <laughs> uh, yeah, so, in two weeks. So now the plan is to go to IKEA. Go to the bathroom. Uh, I went to the bathroom. I need to go to the bathroom now. Oh, why didn't you go there? Eh. We were there for a while. We were there no, for like a half an hour. We always do every time we get IKEA. What do we always do? Sushi. Oh, it's do like we? Tradition. All right, so the place that we were just at is Elm City Games, I believe. They moved. So if you go to the address, it's it's in where are we? Orange Street. No, no. What, where are we? What's, New what, Haven. New Haven, Connecticut. Um, so if you guys want to go check them out, they're super nice. Um, you can do like game night there, and if you um, you can like you can do like kind of like a subscription thing where they have like I think he's at four hundred games. A thousand oh, games? A thousand. a thousand games. Like board games, tabletop games type thing. And you said you pay like 10 bucks a day and play all the games you want? Yeah. And I think you could do a group thing too. He said like 20 or 25 for the group. I don't remember. It's something like that. So it's pretty cool. Um, I wish we lived closer so we could come here and like meet friends and make friends. Um, because, you know, that's why we do YouTube because we don't have friends. Two Ikea. Two cookies cookies. Is that what it's called now? They changed it? No. $25 seems like a lot for that folding chair here. It is. Especially when you can create your bedroom for under $1,000.
So now we're trying to figure out if we should get the brown, the white, or the the tan like we got for upstairs. I thought you said the tan would look bad in the room. I know, I but agree. we still contemplated what we should get. I think we should stick with the brown. The because brown, the darker brown. all of our furniture downstairs is dark brown. Mm. I wish they had that color. Yeah. That's nice. That pretty much matches our, our stuff perfectly. Like legit, like it's pretty close. It's like that reddish brown, almost red, reddish yeah. brown. Doesn't look like it on the camera, but it is. Pulling out, see if it screams. <laughs> I didn't think it would do that. Dude, they're so cool. Look at this one. They're like a sassy leg. Pull it out, see if it screams. How much is this one? 30 bucks, man. It's right there. Oh, some of them are 15. Small pots. There are no small pots. These ones, because this is the large. Oh, okay. Ficus microcarpi ginseng. This one's kind of cool. It looks like a person that's like holding their hands behind their back. Right? Yeah, a little bit. That I like weird. that one. Do you like sassy leg or person? I kind of like person better. It legit looks like it's holding its hands behind its back. Oh, that's super creepy. It definitely looks like a little person. I choose you. They're so cool. All right, where do we go? We gotta look up on the computer, right? No, like seriously though, like the amount of air that that fan moves. Yeah. Do you know what those are called? Fans? No, do you know what the brand is? Brand? Big ass. How'd you know? I could read it. <laughs> yeah, they're big ass fans. I'm surprised they have that. It's amazing. I'm pretty sure that people, these are the TBR cards people have been buying, where they put like the books they want to read It's not on. bad, it's, they're 30 bucks. Yeah, they're pretty cheap. I have nowhere to put it, but. I feel like people always give Ikea, like look at look at my setup right now, Mick. My discreet <laughs> setup. Here, let me take a picture so you can show it in the video. This is my discreet vlogging setup right now. The camera's dying, so we had to plug it in. Uh, but we didn't have the cable, so we had to grab a cable from Ikea. But anyway, um, Ikea gets like a bad rep for like like their furniture being crappy or whatever. It's not the best, but it, it works. It's fine. It's fine. It's great. It works. All right, so we need to find a big cart for you. We right. need to look on the computer and figure out where to find these bookshelves. Yeah. Um, I got tired, so I decided to make somebody else do some of the work. Don't hurt your back now. You done? We bought a mandrake. I don't want to touch it too much. Cute. These are like the closest thing to mandrakes, right? Am I right? Yeah. Am I right? Or am I right? This one has a face too. Look at his little face. He's like hugging, he's like hiding his arms behind his back. Where's this gonna go? Upstairs. I literally just like cleaned off some space so that like I had more space to work on stuff upstairs. Yeah. And then you go and buy a gigantic plant. Like it's, this isn't a small plant. This is a big old plant. So we just made it back home and we're going to, uh, I think, I forgot what she got. Oh yes, to get her uh, her braces stuff. And um, and then we're gonna be going back out, I think, maybe to eat. She wants to get sushi because it's something that we always do whenever we go to Ikea. We always get sushi. And uh, we went to Ikea, so yeah. You wanna go peepees? Evan, you wanna go peepees? Okay, okay. Now you want to go pee pee's? Okay. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We're doing pee pee. Oh, 
Why is it your, why? It's my birthday. Happy birthday, Grandma. Mika, I don't want to get sushi. I know you don't fuck with tradition, but. We always get sushi with Ikea. And then we get fried ice cream. Okay, so the day is almost over. You can see now the sun is setting once again. I think when we left the house, the sun was going up and uh, I was just forced to go get sushi. Forced, mind you. We're gonna go home hopefully tonight and build those bookshelves. And then um, I, I kind of want to do, I don't know what happened there. I kind of want to do a, what is it called, make? Reorganization bookshelf video. I'm trying to get Mikachi to, to do that. You don't look so comfy over there. You look like you're like burping and I stuff. I'm burping. I you have to make room. That's not how that works. Yeah, I want to do that. I, I think we should do that soon. Maybe that video will be coming out soon for you guys. Look at that. You're like a ghost. You <laughs> I don't want to do it tonight. I'm too tired. Uh, I'm exhausted. I'm going to take, you know what? I'm going to take a nap. A good night. <laughs> Thank you.